Elise, I think this is the uh, ninth time you got this. Is that right? Ninth? Okay, yeah. yeah. I assume so, right? I should know. Yeah. Uh, you know, does, I mean, is this just, is, I mean, is it, what's it like? What's it feel like? Is it just whatever? Is it each time, is it like, feels good? Yeah, nine's just like a number at this point, and um, like it's just it's in the past, and I just want to keep moving forward. I mean, getting the player of the week kind of shows that I had a good weekend, but uh, I really just want to continue to focus on like what's ahead of us. So, uh, coach mentioned kind of changing the culture and and uh, things like that at the beginning of the year. Uh, what does that mean, and and you know, have you guys adjusted the way you wanted? Yeah, we haven't had a bad culture. It was just doing the little things, as our assistant coach Bernardo Silva would say, is getting stuck in and, and doing everything you can on and off the field to better this team and better yourself. We have this quote on our door that says, if you're not going to put the team before yourself, turn around. And I guess that's kind of the culture that we established, is this team comes before any individual accomplishments or anything that you do on and off the field. So always keep in mind that this is a team. And I think as a senior and having bought into this new culture change at such a late like term in terms of me being here, it has been um, hard, but I think we've all bought in and it's been just an amazing season so far and we hope to continue what we've done into conference. Yeah, talk about that, your senior year, the, the season you've had thus far, how you guys are clicking really well. Uh, you personally, how important is it that you go out on top as far as Big West play is concerned? For conference play, I feel this will be the last time I will play against most of these players and also against these teams. So you want to have the lasting result with them their senior year. You don't think about the, the game you had against them freshman year. Oh, we beat them. It's like what happens your senior year is what will leave the lasting remarks for anything, just for the games and just for what you want to do here as a player. So um, you talk a lot about kind of having like your, your team mindset, like you, you want to do everything to benefit the team, but get winning this, this um, recognition nine times does show that you are a great offensive player. So my question to you is, this is your senior year, you kind of want to leave a legacy. Mm -hmm. What is your mindset going into each game for, for your play? Like what would you say, like what's your pep talk that you give yourself? What do you think like, okay, I got to do this? I guess as an individual going into these games, knowing that it's my last time ever playing these teams, that, that doesn't, you know, that's enough to, to really motivate myself into these games and, and realize this is the last time I'll be playing against Long Beach. This is the last time I'll be playing against Irvine. And you've been playing in these environments for four years. And I think, like I said, uh, to answer his question, it's something special to get the result your senior year in comparison to like your freshman year because that is what you're going to remember the most. Mm -hmm. It's what happened the last time you played them. And for me, that's really what I just want to continue going into conference play and really come out on top as a player. And sure, I want to score, you know, I want to break more records. But I think as a, as a team, we just want to get the result that we deserve because um, we've put in so much work. And we know that this is the last time we'll play these teams.